Finally, now, nah, Brother Mike Dombosat, to come tell us the truth behind Mazi Inam the Kano, why they never release her up to date. And also, we'll talk about it, like, see why they never release a uh, jelly, because a very dark black major released the video finishing Evangelist Ebuka B, that Evangelist Ebuka B is a Yema for keeping a jelly for over 40 something days because of freedom of speech. We'll be like, see, jelly. As bit, I bet more listen to a very uh, brother Mike. I did hear with you now. One I hear from the Aussies, Matt. So I will start this video by saying, this pastor, you are a yeah, yeah, man. Pastor Ebuka will be, you are a yeah, yeah, man. You don't have, you are a lie lie pastor. That's what I will start. By. Ah, very dark man. I don't know. Say Ebuka will be na yeah, yeah, man. No. we don't know. Yes, now. Nah. I told her before, out of now they see very dark man as on a god. Very soon, very dark man go insult on a papa, insult on a mama. Because this is the reason why they never release Mazina the candle today. Because most of the people who say that they fight for that man, they, they cause more damages, more killing. That is the reason why today the mass they for prison up to now. Very dark man, you are trying to fight now for a jail. But you are causing more damages and more problem. Why will you say, Prophet of BCN, so many people they look up to? Sick people. Plenty of people put up on these prophets. May God use, use them, take it there. You come and hear this. You see, huh? I don't know, say, Prophet, a book of being a useless man, no, say that there is nobody a very dark man, me. It's not a hear person because they arrest the jail. First of all, what did jail do? Eh? I to tweet my mother like this. Very dark idiot. What did he go cause you to talk, say, Prophet Ebukobi Abeg? With due respect, he leaves the jail. He gets family. And this guy gets feelings also. Abeg. Understand? We don't say the guy offends you by bringing your post and come aside. See him like you're picking. Because Jesus Christ don't arrest person. Then bad justice with mercy. It will be no get I go be rich. Even so now bad man he be, but with that word, he get feelings. But he just come and say, Prophet, it will be now yet person be oh. That's a useless man he be. That is a everything they do now yet thing they do. I be now you want wise pass. I be very that man. You will not say prick before, but your prick they online. You will give people advice anyway. Now only foolish person, mumu people. They take word for this idiot called the dark man. Let me so because you could they drag people hearts, but if they drag you, all your mumu fans will say as abomination. No worry, very soon. As very dark man take me sort people spiritual father now. Very soon, he go go to the table now, turn by turn. He go inform everybody, pour their spirit for face. Because Una see now as God. For my ashawo, don't become relevant in Nigeria. Who not said prick before? Mini prick. Anyway, here when they insult prophet, they book up the year No really get respect at all at all. If you be smart, they say for you. Best like if you free even insult God. You just come outside with full confidence. You cannot arrest me. And you get money be. Shame on you. That's the moment they possess you. You go die by fire very soon. So, I will start this video by saying, this pastor, you are a yeah, yeah man. Pastor Epuka will be, you are a yeah, yeah man. You don't have, to, you are a lie lie pastor. That's what I will start by saying. For those of you that don't know this pastor, this is the pastor of Zion Outreach, one very big, massive church, right? So, this pastor now, this guy, his name is Sijeli. This guy has spent 40 days inside prison in Kefi. 40 days. Today, making it 41 days. Why? Because say uh, in talk say the pastor na fake pastor. For that reason, the pastor make sure say they lock the guy up. So you are depriving the guy's children of their father. You are depriving the guy's wife of her husband because of your ego. Was somebody mashed on your ego? Eh? That is why. And Nigerians, you see the problem. This is a very big problem. A lot of innocent people they inside Kujay prison, different prison in Nigeria because of one big man they vex. Because of one rich man somewhere, they vex. They'll just do, they'll go to somebody's side cell. That's what they do. And it's so sad that the police are failing. The justice system is failing. Because how do you lock somebody up for defamation, for crying out loud? Why? 
He said the person are fake. He said the person they collect members money. He said offering when the person they collect are fake. In prophecy are fake. In this one are fake. So what? So what? So what? Now let's even leave the law. Are you not a pastor? Is this what Jesus Christ will do? Eh? Pastor Ebuka, is this what Jesus Christ will do? You people practice everything. You collect that and offering and everything, but you don't practice the one where Jesus Christ tell you. Would Jesus Christ detain somebody for calling him fake? You know how many things the Pharisees do Jesus? So the guy say you the fake pastor. Say hey, you do this or you do that one. The guy buy anybody? No. The guy do fossil entry? No. He still money? No. Defamation of character. Now we go detain person. That is a civil matter for crying out loud. You are supposed to sue him. You know what I'm to Suleiman do Alima? Alima talk about that in just now that post different one. Hey, hey, hey. At the end of the day, what happened? The guy sued her because she could pay 30 million naira to him. You understand? I'm not saying Apostle Suleiman is a good man of God or all that. But see the way the case was handled. Because he knows that that's defamation. Even if I come and say, now say you're the bad person, now defamation. If I say you're the thief, now defamation. You cannot go and detain me. You cannot detain me. You carry your lawyer, I carry my lawyer. If I cannot prove it, you sue me. I collect money. And that's why I thank God. That's why I thank God for that time. The people were handling my case. For SCID against Toto DK, Yabojo and Sam Clef. That's why I thank God. Because this is what they do. When they see somebody that speaks against something, now all now only the guy knows he don't see. Let me call you fake. You go detain her 40 days, depriving the guy of depriving his children of their father for 40 days because of your ego was was stepped on. It's not fair. If you are a true man of God, go and release him. Or I go add more join that defamation by saying your father Nyash, and nobody go do me anything. Yes, they can't lock me up now for defamation. They'll carry me, they'll go sue me. You understand? If my lawyer still defend me, they defend me and come up from there. You cannot detain me. For what? With justice system, they talk about that one. That's not our laws in Nigeria. And I don't know why police they took down for all these kind of things. Now say a lot of bad, bad police just spoil just spoil police work. There are a lot of bad apples in the police. Now for people that don't know what the guy did, look at what he did. Wonderful people, they did it is for us to show everybody that he's a liar, he's a criminal, for saying we can heal anyone. Let him come and prove him. Say we take us to court, no problem. We are waiting for his lawyer. Let his lawyers come, they will show up. Even the guy won't say, he won't say too much. You just wake up, you carry person face, put for banner. Sometimes they say the person are fake. Nigerian self, no, not too much. But then again, if you want to follow the law, this is defamation of character, bro. You can't lock him up. You know, just they use you influence for the wrong thing. It's so sad. So the children now, their papa do they go what? Their mama do they do what? The mama go they cry, they look for me. Come on. And you are a man. Shame on you, as you don't watch this video now, tell me your own point of view. And not also forget to help us like and share. If you have not subscribed or if you have not followed us, follow us for more updates. The one we work for you, take out. The one we not work for you, let it go. You get the point now, so as we know Nigeria is a lawless country. If you they talk about law, the law does not work for the poor, you only work for the rich. So if you be poor man, know how you take the speak the same freedom of speech ability you talk and the same money issue we carry bob with the risky to go spend six months and the same issue kubana chief priest enter come as i come as i call the tell us say money now water move from it